For more news, like, comment and subscribe. Taliban launches major Afghan offensive after deadline for US pullout. Afghan security forces fought back a major Taliban offensive in southern Helmand province in the last 24 hours, officials and residents said on Tuesday, as militants launched assaults around the country after a missed US deadline to withdraw troops. Although the United States did not meet the May 1 withdrawal deadline agreed in talks with the Taliban last year, its pullout has begun, with President Joe Biden announcing all troops will be out by September 11. Critics of the decision to withdraw say the Islamist militants will try to sweep back into power. There was a thunderstorm of heavy weapons and blasts in the city, and the sound of small arms was like someone was making popcorn, Mullah Jan, a resident of a suburb of the Helmand provincial capital Lushkargah, told Reuters. I took all my family members to the corner of the room, hearing the heavy blasts and bursts of gunfire as if it was happening behind our walls, he said. Families that could afford to leave had fled, but he had been unable to go, waiting with his family in fear before the Taliban were pushed back. Atala Afghan, the head of Helmand's provincial council, said the Taliban had launched their offensive on Monday from multiple directions, attacking checkpoints around the outskirts of Lushkargah, taking over some of them. Afghan security forces had carried out airstrikes and deployed elite commando forces to the area. The insurgents had been pushed back, but fighting was continuing on Tuesday and hundreds of families had been displaced, he added. A Taliban surge in Helmand would have particular resonance, as the opium-growing desert province was where US and British forces suffered the bulk of their losses during the 20-year war. As part of the pullout, US forces handed over a base in Helmand to Afghan government troops two days ago. In Washington, the US military said that about 2 to 6 percent of the withdrawal process had been completed so far. United States Central Command said that the equivalent of about 60 C-17 aircraft worth of material had been moved out of Afghanistan, and more than 1,300 pieces of equipment had been handed over to be destroyed. If you like this video, hit the notification button for more news. Thank you for watching.